Hello all, and welcome back to High Priest Play the Ringer. Let's, uh, get into it. <sighs> Oops, forgot to break that intro. Oh well. Done my equipment repair, restocked on supplies, made sure to have some potions of free action and cure disease. Well done, Lapchari. Chaptari. You have done the realm of service, and will not easily forget. Miss across the land will hell your arrival. Now for my part of the bargain. King Cassic Britons, the hammer of Charon onto the anvil. I know I said Charon, or Daron. Listening intently, a slow smile across, spreads across his features. Just in you, he inscribed the location of the entrance of Thagatha somewhere in the north of part of Marwan on Charon's map. Ah, map. Let's just... There we go. Alright, let's hit it up. Oop. Left kick instead of right. Morrowind. Let's get to the second last dungeon then. Dang up. Dagoffer, the sacred entrance of the Dwarven Smith to the Fire Mountain. <clears throat> Dagoffer stands before you. Magical runes glow in the red firelight, shimmering with heat. Sulfurous gouts of steam escape from vents within the rock base of the opening. The final piece of staff chaos beckons. I'm actually gonna... Uh, let's see if I can... Yeah, that was a pointless one, sure. Man, I lucked out with that, uh, one golem giving me that key. Even if I'm, I'm annoyed, it didn't work on all those doors. And that's why I do that little, uh, circle pattern thing. You enter the fire of love. Dagatha. Around you, the air shimmers with heat. Even the stone floor is warm to you.
that. Never mind, that was a terrible idea. Drop. Bam. Let me get over here. Drop down. Drip. Right, okay. You, you ever toy around with the idea for video game plots for fun? Uh, I, I always like RPGs and plots of story and background to them, so I like coming up with a little the background details you find well in a game like, not exactly like Task, more of a JRPG, but with, uh, some of the deep lore and some semi-confusing lore of tasks. In fact, I started brainstorming one last aside just, you know, for fun of it. It, it doesn't help that I've thought about making what some of these games are for. An RPG maker. But I, uh, I don't have RPG maker. And, uh, I don't know how to code, so... I mean, I, you don't, technically don't need to know how to code, but knowing how to code is helpful because it lets you take. You need to, if the RPG maker can't do something you don't, know, you want to do, you can figure out a way around it. Yeah, this idea is never likely to be made, but I've got. I feel like. Head resting on it. Oh, thank God. Ah, oh, good. You didn't knock me back in there. Where are you? Stone Golem or Storm, storm Golem? Out exactly where to swing with these ghosts. For some reason, I thought that one was moving. Because I should have realized these things don't move around me. That'd be too advanced. Similar from the stars, but that goes drastically different places. Yeah, you know, and I'll be in a narrate how the world, a world once cute, covered in beautiful greenery, was reduced to a desert landscape with only a few life bearing spots here and there. And most of them man made or otherwise. And that what causes destruction. Oh wow, am I already here? Oh, 
Oh. Oh, they're just... Uh, hold on. Right, okay, I'm probably gonna end up having to, uh... Whoa! Okay, I jumped. That was not where I was go wanting to go. I gotta kill these two guys. Alright, let's see what this level experience gives me. I forgot to put my boots back on. Whoops. Right, okay. Oh, and Necromancer's Elmo. Oh, that was. That's a big. A jump on my part. Right, okay. Right, let's see. Where's my. Belt of Strength. Huh. Well, looks like I need a new belt. I should have had another one prepared ahead of time then. Oh, time to loot everything for belts. Stop. <sighs> Not what I want. Keep going until I find a belt. And loot it.
Just go to that room. Geometry. What is the Lovecraft story? Lovecraft, if you're not familiar with Lovecraft, see, let me say that what a Lovecraft story is someone gets eaten by the geography. I should save at this point. Yeah, let's make sure I don't lose the okay. Yes, I need to make another hammer font. I wanted to use that for the last one, but I still hadn't given it back to the dude yet, so I didn't feel like I could use it. Why did I hit that out? Wait. Oh, no. Well, at least I got... Okay, wait, I forgot. I failed to account for the extra health there. Being add on, so I probably still haven't taken any damage yet. Oh, I actually forgot to go back down that one this way. Yes, I do, in fact, see an iron golem. Thank you. I, I flop between finding the, the little announcements like that charming and finding them annoying. Because if it's in a D&D game, you don't need to tell me when I see something. You can go, it's the Iron Girl, but you see an Iron Girl. But... No, I, I don't think there's a reason to tell me it's Iron Girl, really. Okay, you. You can just die. Right here, right now. Thank you for that. Just what I wanted. Let's 
see what's down here. Thank you for opening the door for me. Oh, you brought your friend, eh? Life and comfy in day and hell. I tried to cover uh, the ball for a while there, but. Let's kill this guy. Out here. I was gonna kill this kill that guy, but now I wanna find a place to hop up onto.
There we go. Not hit the broad side of a barn. Yeah, I'll keep going for a little bit. I ain't sorry, this is just that. Okay. Let's find a place we can get up onto and camp. That is the edge, right? There's a... Uh... That branching area don't look like it. Why would it branch like that if it was actually the edge? Yeah. Is the area I'm looking for? Yay! fully heal, hop off, and save. I'm not dumb enough to try saving on here because I've been messed up by the uh, saving feature before on this thing. So, way early on, I spawned inside a wither. Save. Nothing to have. <laughs> Right, okay, <clears throat> if you enjoyed this video, then please like, comment, and subscribe to Cypress Sign On. I will see you all next time, folks.